it's just a little tough in that sense. But hey, I mean, we we, we put ourselves in positions to win, but now we just got to do it. Tony was just saying just now that he's not going to, you know, drop his head, and he doesn't expect anybody else to either. But the only thing he can do, left to do still is just a, just a fight. Yeah, and there, there's there's no give up in this team. This is a resilient team, like we've been saying through this this tough course that we've been going through. So uh, I don't expect anybody to go down, any, go and come into practice tomorrow with their head down. I expect you know, me include everybody to come in work even that much harder, and then try to get this get the second winner to see. A little soul searching now in this bye week that maybe might not have happened if you got a W here tonight. I mean, we started off 1-3. Whether we won this game or not, we're, we're going to have to look ourselves in the mirror and want to figure out how to get this thing rolling in the right direction. So whether we were 2-3 and three or 1-4, and four, that was going to happen anyway. So, you know, it's just, like I said, you know, we gotta we got to just figure out what's going on and make sure we get it correct. Thomas, how frustrating is this? A little bit. I'll be, be lying if I say it was frustrating, but like I said before, we're a resilient team, we're a veteran team, and we, we know that we have the talent and the, and the scheme to get this thing correct. What is it that you think this team lacks the most? Uh, just finishing. Just being able to close games out, halves out, drives out, plays out, just finishing. Just making sure that we play to and through the whistle and, and, and play on that line. Finishing games is something this team able to do last year. What's different? Can you pin it? Not, not right now. I have, we'll have to go back to the to, to the film room and really try to, you know, pinpoint what's going on and where the miscues are.